to my brand new series, aside from the theme park stuff, Behind the Curtains, which is a theatre review show. So whenever I go and see a show, or I go and see a theatre performance, or some kind of uh, live entertainment, basically I do a review on them. Because I'm studying acting, I feel very proud of what I'm starting to achieve with this series. Uh, Hopefully the Met, I might do a separate YouTube channel just for acting stuff, uh, for the latest acting news on theatre, film, television, all that performing art stuff. If you haven't realised already, it's a J2O. Got to keep my voice intact. <laughs> so, um, yeah, this is episode one of Behind the Curtains, and this one is Of Mice and Men, originally by John Steinbeck, but directed by Jan Townsend, here at Cast Theatre in my hometown, Doncaster. So, um... We're at a 20 minute interval at the minute, there's about 10 minutes left of it, uh, so I'm going to have to get this intro done uh, quite soon, just so I can take the place and stuff like that. So, um, yeah, so, uh, the first half was really, really good, the acting quality is amazing, um, if you haven't seen, or if you haven't heard about Of My Men, basically, a uh, bit of a spoiler, it's about uh, these two guys, George and Lenny, and they sort of, like, um, uh, go into like Phelps Ranch uh, so um, yeah it's, it's a good story loads of different characters it's set around the wild west sounds you know like after the Great Depression after the Wall Street crash you know stuff like that the first half in terms of the acting quality was amazing um, I think the dog was absolutely adorable um, I think um, I think the lighting could have been a bit Personally, for me, I felt the lighting could have been a bit better, if you know what I mean. I mean, there are some good places. I mean, the lighting, there are some fantastic places it was for the lighting. Uh, but personally, I feel as if um, it could have been some better placements. Um, so that's, the re that's a quick review of the first half. Now, I'm going to go back into the second space to watch the second half. Um, and yeah, I'm going to watch the second half of Of Mice and Men, and I'm going to give you, uh, I'm going to watch the second half, then I'm going to go home, and then I'm going to see, I'll see you guys back in my, uh, theme park universe, or my bedroom, uh, just to review the second half of the performance, so I'm going to drink my J2O, I'm going to get into this space for the second half, and, uh, yeah, good show, so, so far, out of ten, I give it a good six and a half, to 7 out of 10. Not quite sure, I'll have to judge it on the second half, whether it increases, whether it decreases. Uh, but yeah, let's time to watch the second half and let's check out our review. So I'm back home now, ready to review the second half um, of the show. The second half was so much better. So, so much better. Um, I think... The acting quality was better in the second half than the first half, and I definitely think there wasn't any problems, in my opinion, in the second half. I think, um, obviously, I said about the, light, the lighting mishap, uh, and that could have been improved in the first half. There wasn't any really, anything to improve on in the second half. I think, overall, it's a fantastic show. Um, I think all the props were placed in the right place. The set looked incredible. Overall, uh, the acting quality is just stupendous, um, and yeah, it's it's absolutely amazing. So, what would I rate the show out of ten? Um, now, I said in the first half I give it six and a half or seven. After the second half, I would give it a good eight out of ten. It's it's you know it's one worth watching. Obviously, it's finished now. This tonight was last night, so it's not could be on anymore but um you know it was a great show well well it lasted so that is it then for the first ever behind the curtains theater review the next review is going to be from this so this is the gary clark company's coal uh, which is going to be on only on one day uh wednesday the 14th i'm going with college but i'm gonna go in there earlier to do a opening and do some filming afterwards as well um so it won the uk theater award and it won the critics circle national dance award so it is a dance piece it's been given four four stars from the stage four stars from the times and five from the big issue 
So that will be the next review and that will be on Wednesday the 14th of February. So thank you for watching the first ever Behind the Curtains episode. Tune in for episode 2 which is going to be Cole at Cast Theatre again. Um, and make sure you tune in tomorrow and Sunday as well because we're going to have the very first episode on the European Entertainment Show. And I'll talk more about that tomorrow but for now it's time to roll out the red carpet, roll down the curtains... And it's time to end the show. Mm -hmm.